How's it going everyone? My name is Miguel Fuentes and today is our another weekly vlog. Uh vlog I think number seven I think. But uh I kind of forget, you know, but anyway. Uh so this week was pretty amazing week. Um Monday I did have uh, a phone interview with my doctor. Um hopefully you know everything turned out alright and stuff and then Tuesday uh, I did get a uh, doctor's note that I can return back to work, uh, but I gotta be aware of the CDC guidelines. Uh, but further than that, you know, I'm, I'm you know, uh, trying to keep my blood sugar in control, uh, not not to be out of control. I do have just a little bit of insulin left, so I'm trying to be wise of what I'm eating and, and you know, all that good stuff. Anywho, um, so yeah, so Tuesday I went back to the clinic and I, and they checked my A1C and my A1C is 7.3, which is pretty good, um, pretty, pr pretty good, uh, you know, I've been working hard a month, a month and a half to really get my blood sugar in control, um, and to into not not I mean, but also with exercises and stuff, um, and becoming more insulin sensitive, and I, and I found out that you know, taking a uh, soaking in a hot bath for thirty minutes to forty five minutes uh, helps control my blood sugar because for some reason it it it, it has the same. Effect. Uh, the same hormone that you know you go exercise and stuff like that the the muscles go and you know, the muscles start to absorb more quickly when it's warm and so you know it, it really really helps uh i remember uh i think it was last week uh i was you know, i injected just a little bit of in insulin after i ate uh lunch and so so i went in and Soaking a hot bath for thirty to forty five minutes and uh, after after that hot bath uh fifteen minutes later i my body began began to shake and tremble like oh what's going on and so I did check my blood sugar it was ninety eight which is from two hundred thirty six to ninety eight that that's a that, that's a big drop so i'm I'm glad that my body is reacting to um that impact, I should say. Um, and then Wednesday, I come, I came back to work. Uh, I'm, you know, better, and I do, I do need to uh, uh, speed up my pace a little bit. I've been to sluggish, uh, sluggish recently, and so I gotta work on that uh for sure but anywho for education uh i did the uh geology so not geology uh yeah geology three uh western uh the western europe map uh filling out all the countries and stuff i did the uh applied visual designs lessons twenty eight through thirty five and I did my first uh, actually, uh, course 8 of the Jerusalem uh, Academy and I did my quiz 1 and I passed with a A minus. Uh, Tuesday I did Zoology 2 chapters 12 and then I did the uh, Applied Visual Design uh, lesson 36 through 45. Did one hour of uh, practice coding and then I did the Course eight, lesson two. Wednesday, when I went back to work, uh, let's see. Um, I did college algebra chapter two. Uh, uh, applied visual designs. Uh, lessons forty-five to fifty-two, which I'm finished with that, gratefully, and I did uh, quiz two. And I did my teaching video as you see on, on YouTube. Thursday, 
Um, I did the the history of England too. King King John and uh, King Henry the uh, Third. I took a new unit called Applied Accessibility Lessons. One. Well, actually, I didn't do that Thursday because I was coming home late. And I'm exhausted, but I did do Course Eight, uh, Lesson Three. Uh, and then I did uh, ex Applied Accessibility uh, Lessons 1 through 16. I did caught up, thankfully, and I did uh, Course 8 Quiz, uh, Quiz number 3. Praise God. And today, Saturday, I did Systematic Theology 3, uh, Chapter 30. Uh, which is about uh, the works of the Holy Spirit and stuff like that. Um, I did finish the uh, apply, access, sorry, applied uh, accessibility uh, lesson 17 to 22. And then I did a new unit, which is kind of short, like four, four lessons called, um, oh, what was it? Uh, God, I can't remember what I'm talking about my head. Um, it's it's a very short short lesson, so you know I'm 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 a little bit more caught up than before. Uh, later I'm gonna be doing a one hour coding practice, and I did uh, lesson four of uh, the course eight in uh, New Jerusalem. Tomorrow's plan is to do the the book of Romans. Chapter two, uh, course eight, uh, quiz four, one hour practice practicing coding, and doing my sermon and stuff like that, and planning my week because I do have a planner which really helps you to not only uh, write down your to do list and stuff like that that you need to get done. Um, but but also you know having a bullet journal can help you you know write down your goals and write down what the Lord is teaching you and stuff like that or if you're not a Christian just write down what what you're thankful for. So again, I thank God for watching. Uh, I'm glad that I'm work. I'm back to work again, and I'm trying to be uh, be positive. Uh, trying, trying to control my blood sugar as much as I can. Uh, my goal for the for the next A1C test on August will be um, at least 6.7. That's my goal. That's my next goal to get to get it down from 7.3 to 6.7, and and I'll be in good shape. So. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for for uh, for your for for you guys support. Um, you guys have been awesome. I thank you guys for not only giving uh, positive comments, and um, I pray that the Lord will use you in a mighty way. So I uh, thank you guys for watching. May God bless you. I'll see you guys again next time.